In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a stop loss on the Blowfin spot market. Let's get into the video. To set up a stop loss for a crypto that you hold on account, we'll first have to enter the spot market. So we're going to come right up here and we'll click where it says spot. This will bring us into the spot market user interface. The next step is to choose the crypto that you hold on account that you wish to set up a stop loss for. And you'll find the pairings if you come right up here, top left hand side and click right here. So in my case where it says BTC USDT. Then you'll get a drop down with all the different pairings that are available on Blowfin. At the time of recording, the pairings are quoted in Tether. So this means you'll be receiving Tether for the sale of your crypto if your stop loss gets hit. So simply click on the crypto pairing of the crypto that you hold on account, or you can search for it in the search bar up above. In my case, I have a little bit of Bitcoin, so I'll demonstrate with that by simply clicking on BTC USDT. The next step is head up here to the order panel and click on sell, then click on trigger. Now we need to choose a trigger price for our stop loss. So let's head on over here to the chart. And for the purposes of demonstration, let's imagine that I want to set my stop loss somewhere just below these wicks right here. We can see that Bitcoin's currently finding a little bit of resistance here on the nine simple moving average. And maybe I'm thinking to myself, if Bitcoin fails to break through there and continues to roll over from here, getting below these wicks, that maybe I want to set my stop loss and get out of the way. Maybe I think if Bitcoin gets below this level here, that it's probably just going to move lower. And I don't want to take any further losses on my Bitcoin position at that time. So what I'll do is I'll go ahead and grab a horizontal here from the drawing tools, just like so. And I'll go ahead and mark a spot on this chart just below those wicks, giving it a little bit of room to breathe here. So maybe something like this. Now I can see a price point on the Y axis of the chart coming in at 59,448. And let's imagine that I want to use that as my trigger price to trigger my stop loss to sell my Bitcoin. So we'll come back over here to the order panel and I'll type that into trigger price. We'll go 59,448. In this box here where it says order price, we'll go ahead and leave this set to market and we'll make sure this box over here is also set to market. This means that if our trigger price gets hit, that our coins will sell immediately for the best available price off of the order book. Next, we'll choose the amount of the asset that we wish to sell if our stop loss gets hit. So for this demonstration, I'll just use this slider bar and I'll put it up to 100% like so. But once you get your stop loss set up the way that you want it, you just come down here and click on sell. Then you'll get your order confirmation pop-up window. So you can confirm the details are what you intended. This looks fine to me. So I'm going to come down here and click on confirm. Now I've set up a stop loss. So if Bitcoin does reject from here and moves down, hitting my stop loss at 59,448, my coins will be sold immediately, the best available price off the order book. I can also see the details of my trigger order if I come down here, click on open orders, then click on trigger. And here's where you'll see your trigger order that you set up as your stop loss. At any point, if you'd like to cancel it, just come over here on the right hand side and click on cancel. And as you can see, I just removed that trigger order. And there you have it. That's how you can set up a stop loss on the Blowfin spot market. If you got some value out of that, don't forget to leave me a like and hit subscribe for future content. Also, feel free to check out some of my other Blowfin tutorials, which I've put together in a playlist on my YouTube channel. Thanks so much for coming by and checking out this video. Looking forward to seeing you in the next one. And until I do, have yourself a powerful day.